Hi, good morning. This is Coach Robbie, and I'm going to um, share with you or do the training for you. Then this is called NDO or New Distributors Orientation. So if you are new in this business, this will be very helpful to you, so that you can be become more motivated and you'll understand deeply or you'll understand the process what's what you're going to take especially if it's just your first month or first week or even you already took years after you have joined but haven't attended NDO I'm really sure that this can help you a lot so let's start with the training and according to Tom Bigal Tom Bigal is uh, uh, one of the very successful in network marketing in USA and according to him there are three things that you needed to succeed in network marketing and the same also uh, in Aime global you needed three things for you to succeed the number one is very important okay one big compelling reason to do it okay what's your reason why you are doing in global to whom do you offer the success so when you become successful who do you offer the success and that maybe can be your motivation to do or even if uh, there's lots of rejections or discouragement that will come along the way because just to tell you honestly there's lots of rejections and discouragement that will come along the way so you should have one big compelling reason to do it okay because your reason will keep you going no matter how many people will discourage you will laugh at you will not believe at you whatever struggles that you, that may come into your life while you are doing in global well first it can be you can get through of it if you have one big compelling reason to do it if you are working abroad or working away from your family and that could be your compelling reason to whom do you offer the success maybe when you become successful you can go together with your family okay or maybe when you become successful you can work as full-time and become your own boss okay you don't work nine to five and still with no savings and that could be your compelling reason to whom do you offer what's your reason big compelling reason because if your reason why you're doing in global is not deep as, uh, as it seems that uh, if if you'll do in global or not then it's okay then probably your success in this business is very low or very little chance at least you have one big compelling reason okay the second one is you should have good learning attitude or you should have GLNA and because when if, if you are hung, hungry always for success you'll always seek guidance from the person who knows about the business so that's very important that you, sh you should have good learning attitude and of course excellent the skills now for the skills it's uh, learnable and anyways we are doing the trainings and the skills can be learned okay because some some people has probably you uh, you know already some people who do who didn't succeed in a global or those people who quit in a global some people are, might be asking what will i do nothing happened to my in global business and one big reason is could be they don't have one big compelling reason to why they are doing a global so for them when once they rejected they easily quitted Okay? But if you have one big compelling reason why you are doing in global, then no matter how many rejections you will encounter, you will not quit. Okay, Probably they don't, they don't have good learning, listening attitude. That's why they fail. That's why they, did, that's why they quit. But here in a global, there, there's no failure. Only those people who are quitting, that's why they are failing. If you'll keep going on no matter how slow you are in doing the business then that will not matter as long as you keep going on you are not a failure okay you only fail once you quit so don't quit so to avoid this you should follow those three things that you should have and on this business we'll uh, 
you learn those three three things and the bigger picture will I'll share you or I'll teach you uh, about the bigger picture I'll let you understand about this in global okay so number one you should be your own CEO I'm not saying that become the owner of a global but take ownership of your business that's what it meant because when you are the CEO or if you take ownership of your business you will do whatever it takes okay you will protect your business you will you make your business grow because you are the CEO you, you own your business you'll do whatever it takes so take ownership become the CEO of your business anyways once you since you are already joining in global we are not your boss okay i'm not your boss your applied is not your boss the owners are not your boss but we are business partners okay be your own ceo take charge or take ownership of your business and also apply the law of leverage in here the, the law of leverage is actually the basic or the simple explanation is you multiply your time and effort through others okay uh, it, that's the secret of what to, to wealth and if you'll research a lot about the successful people or if you'll research about the law of leverage you'll you'll know that this it most of the successful or all of the successful people right now has applied the law of leverage okay so so later i will tell you more about the law of leverage you'll understand it more and also you'll understand that in this business this is a helping business okay your upline is helping you and uh, your your sponsor is helping you your cross lines your mentors is helping you this is a total helping business also learn to and learn so what this mean is if if you have a good profession if you have a good job if you have a good position then try to learn it for a while and learn it for a while so that the new knowledge will absorb you'll absorb new knowledge about the global since this is new you should be humble to learn from those things who knows about the business okay for you also to become successful because success is the combination of the basic or knowledge or attitude and the skills okay so these are the basics especially if there's already an office in your country so you should prepare your business kit your products global pack application forms notebook and ball pen as well whiteboard marker if needed or business cards these are just the basic of to do to have so you should have attend or learned about the important trainings in AIM Global, okay? The OPP or the product demo, and the OPP or product demo is the business presentation. It will, it, the in that OPP, we explain the products and also the marketing plan. So it's called the OPP or product demo. All right, and uh, NDO. This is called NDO. Right, new distributors orientation and another one another training is called ASAP and there's two part ASAP 1 and ASAP 2 so in ASAP 1 the importance of training why not working so another set of good training and the basic skills for the ASAP 2 so those of the, especially if you have an access to the trainings you shouldn't miss those train things as the success or the training is the foundation of success okay so you should attend it at least five times if you have an access to the training okay so this is what i'm saying so training is the foundation of success so this tree if you can see this tree it has roots what if this tree and has the root of very uh not a strong root this this tree will probably with just a small or weak wind then probably this tree will be uprooted same with this building what you can see that appears from the ground from here up there it also what you, you, the foundation should be also as high or as tall as the what you can see about the ground what if the foundation of the building is just the first floor okay 
the foundation which is buried in the in the ground and the building is up to 10th floor then probably we cannot say that it's a strong building so foundation is really needed just like this tree in this building training also is the foundation of the success here in Aim global because once you learn the business you understand it you understand the process you gain skills you got a good learning and listening attitude you got you got good mentors and it's really impossible if you will fail in this business just don't quit and have all those things that i've mentioned then your success is is uh, possible here okay fear while doing this business there's lots of fear okay but you know what the meaning of fear it's false emotion appearing real fear is only in our mind okay why do you fear maybe there's there's something happened in the past okay maybe you are overthinking of the future okay maybe you are thinking that what happened what hap what will happen if i fail you are you are already thinking of ahead in which is negatively okay so fear always remember it's <coughs> it's a false emotion appearing real it's only in our mind place should uh, fear should have no place in here and now right learn to fight your fear when you ever you feel fear just learn to conquer okay learn to fight it learn to get through it and that's normal to every person okay you will fear a lot but learn to become strong and fight your fear overcome your fear in here sometimes in Ink global especially if you are new there's lots of fear of rejection that's one part you fear to invite your friend because your friend might reject you you fear to invite your family your family might reject you you fear to talk to the stranger that you met on the bus or walking on the street because the, the stranger might the stranger might um, of uh may, may not believe you so that's one part of fear okay learn to overcome the fear because fear is just normal but learn to overcome okay whenever you feel fear there are two things that you can do okay this the number one whenever you feel fear you can forget everything and run don't face the fear just run but you know probably that's not the best that's not the best thing to do the best thing to do whenever you feel fear you face everything and rise so all of us all of us has a choice all of us is fearing fear so what would you do would you run and forget about that about it don't face it or you will face it and you will rise soon okay the choice is yours fear is normal fear is present to everybody but you have two choice choose the number two face it okay face it and rise because when you fear when you feel has feeling of fe fear and it also causes doubt and when you doubt and you fear that will take you no action okay like this one a very good example you fear to invite your friend because you are not sure if the business of within global is good okay so you will take no action so in the future you will never gain result so that's a good example the doubt and fear what if you re invert it okay invert it instead of doubt for you to remove the doubt you should study about the business you should ask your mentor you should train a lot so that you will be learnable okay the doubt and the fear will take no action learn to overcome those two okay because here rejection is very normal you know in every life there's rejection is always normal so rejection is a recipe of success if you will 
study or if you will do a research of those most successful people nowadays they have experienced a lot of fear a lot of fear I mean a lot of rejection of course fear also a lot of rejection so every successful pe- person has a painful story every painful story has a successful ending okay and accept the pain and get ready for success there's a, a, a an example of rejections that I'm going to show you okay so in here attitude is really very important you develop your attitude your good learning and listening attitude because along the way you will experience fear doubt rejections but if you have a good attitude probably you can overcome those right mind the power of words because mind is very important it was uh, I mean thinking is very important and mind is so powerful it's being said okay, that whatever the mind of man can believe and conceive it can be achieved so if you think that you can that's true and if you think you can that's true also so the choice is yours would you believe or not, or would you believe that you can or would you believe that you cannot both of those two, th- two things is possible or can be true to you so mind your words always input positivity instead of negativity okay when negativity like uh like these thoughts of like oh, i don't like to do in global because it's probably will not last long that's a negative thought what if you think this way i will work hard in a global because after two to three years i'm already a successful man or women okay that's a good example avoid negativity in your mind because whatever it the mind of man can conceive and believe it can be achieved so the power of brain so of course have a belief belief believe in the company believe believe in the products believe in the appliance the company for you to have a belief with the company you should research you should research a lot for the products you should have watched videos you can ask your down your uplines or your mentors if you don't know more about the products you can ask for materials so that your belief can be can make can make it stronger okay so belief is very important believe in the company the products the appliance downlines and itself also okay among all <clears throat> don't forget to believe in yourself because it's very important like this man and if probably you already know watch him he's one uh, of the very inspirational people in this world and he has a lot of videos also on YouTube so imagine this guy what if you are is this guy you don't have hands you don't have legs but you know this guy became so an inspirational even a motivational uh, people right now a motivational speaker right now so among all that just have a belief in the company the product yourself also believe in God this is the most and very important among all believe in the God and also become committed have a commitment because there are three things or three commitments to those people that join in global you know those those people will just say I will try well those people that will just say I will try they don't have deep commitment in a global and probably when along the way they experience rejection doubt fear they will quit easily because their commitment is not strong it's not deep just some other people will just say I will do my best okay still that's not a, a good commitment at all okay I will do my best still that is still not a deep commitment 
maybe if just few some rejections you still this can be discouraged okay but you know that there is the the, the best commitment that you should say to yourself this is really the best so far and it seems that your life relies on this when you say i will do my best whatever it takes then it seems that you are putting your life depending on it because if you are putting your life defend depending on it it depends your life in here you will do everything it seems that you are fighting for your life okay so it, be or have this the, this third commitment do your best whatever it takes of course there are the discouragement but learn to discipline yourself on how to handle them okay the discouragement or handle those who will discourage you who will discourage you of course this is very number one your loved ones like say you invited in you were invited in global and you join and once you talk to your wife your wife or your husband or your family or your loved ones it's not good about it about what you told them that you're joining global or you joining in global there's that's already a discouragement but you know discouragement is actually already part of people's life that we are not just aware of but since you get discouraged because you're joining global and I think this this hurts a lot because you are new into this okay but actually you experience already a lot of rejections in which you are just not aware of it okay so who will discourage you the loved ones number one the negative people okay and other network marketing companies sometimes will discourage you so they are trying to say that their company is good right so the most the the, the one that i have experienced also the discouragement from loved ones sometimes it you will feel so discouraged especially from loved ones but you know you if you will just use it as your motivation when your loved ones discourage you it can also your tool for you to become successful because you are doing in global not just for you but of course for your loved ones sometimes they don't understand yet and it's okay because they don't understand it yet of course they are negative but the, in the future once they understand the business they will truly love uh, or they will believe you but always just think about this that discouragement is normal you'll encounter it along the way when you are doing a global and that tells you that you are doing the right way because if you will not experience rejection discouragement then you are not inviting people and when you are not inviting you will not have downline and you will gain no result right so discouragement love it and also rejections of course become excited so <coughs> because when you are excited especially when you have a news okay you'll talk this to your friend you'll say this to your friend become excited it seems that <clears throat> uh, become so excited that your friend will not will be eager to learn from you will be eager to hear, hear about this about the englobe okay excitement is also important and also focus okay especially when you become open-minded in network marketing business you are already joining global and you encounter some other network marketing companies will probably they will encourage you to join their company sometimes they bad mouth in global so just focus okay we always remember this there's no perfect company but your success will surely depends on you Okay, there's no perfect company there is just better in a global is better okay and already established with name okay don't put your reputation joining those new companies because along the way if that company is a scam then your name 
will be affected your reputation okay since in global is a better company with a good marketing plan with a good product just focus in in global also have some goal for you to have an action plan what could be your sum of your goals your goal could be your goal income your goal downline and also do an action plan so who are those people that you can invite in in global learn to write them and it's called prospect list okay have also a skills in prospecting so if your it could be your family friends neighbor classmate to whoever club members also or former office mates okay those are prospects in that you can invite so th these are the skills or the ways on how you can invite you can invite them to come to the office to learn the presentation once they like the business and they can join you know, it's not you who is presenting you just invite them to the office let them sit down if you are near the office let them sit down and someone or they there is a speaker most of the time in our offices you can bring your invite or guest so one-on-one -on -one, uh, what I uh, actually discussed to you the invitation to the office is called um, uh, centering okay that's already part of the presentation and the second one is one-on-one -on -one. you can invite your friend for a uh, over a cup of coffee and this is uh, good to uh, do for those people who are busy they don't have enough time to sit in a presentation room and hear the two year pre uh, two, two day um, two hour presentation <coughs> to our presentation and uh, listen to the presenter so probably you you will just need a one on one so those are just some you can also do house party and house party you'll just invite your friends your colleagues to your house and then you'll do presentation it's not the typical house party it's called house presentation it's to be easily understood house presentation this one I'll skip for now because this is only this is applied when you have you go to the office and you have your upline with you so the formula of success is the product share it sell it sponsor more people and seek guidance so this is the process that i'm going to explain to you your success will come from you okay from everybody from every one of us who is a member of in global it will start from you as a member but have a good learning and listening attitude why because when you have a good learning and listening attitude you can learn okay when you learn of course you can teach what you have learned okay and when you can teach you you will be duplicated duplicated means your downlines also can do what you can do okay when you duplicated you will delegate Okay, you delegate the task say for example you ask your downline to to present a product presentation your other other downline will do the marketing plan or you let them uh, prepare the venue that's part of delegation of the task because when you delegated them to them you will multiply it's not only you has been doing remember that network marketing business is a business of people so you you have to leverage multiply or leverage is just almost the same multiply your time and effort <clears throat> and that's called leverage when you multiply and your network grows that's come that comes your income your big dreams your dream car your dream income 
your dream travel it's because of the network the network is a group of people that you have coaches that you have coach that you have teach that you have mentored and it's called network network is a group of people right so your goal is to grow your network but of course it will start from here from GLA that will start from GLA for you to have a big network and get your dreams some other people has been asking why I did not succeed in Anglobal and why people some why some people did not succeed or did not get their dreams okay they did not get their dreams because they don't have big network okay they don't have big network because they did not multiply or they did not leverage themselves why they were not the leverage because they they did not delegate the task to their downlines and they did not duplicate why they did not duplicate because they did not teach their people or their downlines or their team okay and why because there's no learning why there's no learning because there is no there is no good learning and listening attitude well the GLA means whatever advice of your upline you should always say yes except if that if what advice if the advice is not good and you think it's immoral and ethical then don't follow it but if your upline is advising you to to do the trainings attend trainings to come to this event you should follow it and that's called GLA good learning and listening attitude when you why people did not succeed because they don't have GLA okay they keep asking upline why I should attend upline I don't have that money to attend I don't have time to go to attend to the training that's part one part of distributor or member who don't have GLA so that's why they did not succeed or those people will have no GLA will slowly become uh, will prog progress but slowly in a global so that's the process and that's very important so always remember to keep learning don't give up on your dreams always seek God in whatever you do and that's the end of the training so my final word for you since you are already within global you have to continually uh, do the business share it to people and have your motivation with it you know while we are doing the presentation to you while we talk this presentation to you and that could be you could you can be motivated but you know that the best motivation that you can have is your self motivation even if nobody is telling you that you should continue that you should move on that you should face your fear you can do it yourself because you are truly you have self motivation that's what you needed to learn and for you to have that you should understand the business more okay but just like what I'm telling you the foundation of the success is the training along the way there are struggles there are hard work that you should do and there are challenges lots of challenges because if there's no challenge then there's no thrill also become successful with no effort then everything every people will all will become will succeed with no effort and that the success will have no value so have your self motivation and fly as a leader keep learning and do your part in aim global so this is once again this is coach robbie until next and till to the next training yes.